Get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick-me-up. How much farther do we have to go? Not far. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back, then. I'll set the bomb. Can't wait to see you, Marley. Can't wait to take a hot shower. Fire in the hole! <laughs> you sure told those doors. Let that be a Let's lesson for anything that gets in my way. Attention all citizens. Attention all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified intruders have detonated a bomb inside Mako Reactor 1. Multiple explosions have been confirmed, as well as ongoing fire. In response, a disaster warning has been issued in sectors 1 and 8. Structures in the area are at high risk of collapse, rendering the entire sector hazardous. Therefore, all residents have been No. No way. This couldn't have been us, could it? But what if it was? What's done is done. <laughs> Merck's right. It ain't pretty, but we can't stop now. This was just the first reactor. And the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah. We always knew this was going to get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all got to look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, because I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. Your fears. Your worries, your concerns, and yes, your fears. Whatever your problem, I got you. Huh? Hmm. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home! Hmm. Hmm. for the last train home. Regroup in the freight car. Got it? Later then. Hey. I'd like my money now. You can have it once we're back at base. you what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing material. You can have it, for saving my life. Just doing my job, nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <laughs> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. And you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. <laughs> yeah, well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? Damn it. 
You're not real. You're... dead. I, uh... I killed you with my own... <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Right. The sound of her voice. Pleading beneath this bed. The shiver of her flesh yielding to cold steel. That which binds us together would be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bet! 
Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right. You got this. Too weak to save anyone. Not even yourself. Are you okay? Hey, are you okay? I'm fine. Here, this is for you. I heard that, you know. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- <gasps>
you blind? You know, you're right. Yeah. Wait! Nice meeting you. Sword on the ground! Right now! No holding back. Not bad. Target's still open! 
fire! Shoot to kill! Close call. Be advised! Target approaching residential area! Seal Hall action immediately! Target sighted! Get him! It's all or nothing now. You're done. No more. 
Let's go.
This is Sector 8, Unit 2. Target is surrounded. Moving to secure. Wait! I know them. This Cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? To, huh? <laughs> Giving public security the runaround? That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> hmm. Wait. Hmm? Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. A lot of people here. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? This Look at us. We've got a crowd to hide here. Head for the front of the train to hold there. Due to an explosion at Marco Reactor 1, an emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. Wow, you look like the people riding the freight car. So oh, never mind. Sorry to disturb you. How they call the perpetrators. Hey, got a sec? Don't be stupid. Yeah, the slums need power too, you know. I can't It'll help out, please. I can't stop thinking about it. The bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail-safes to prevent that kind of thing? Hmm. You mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. Good thing there'll be electricity, Wilbur. I'm sure Sector's What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? <sighs> Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking <gasps> out your ass. <gasps> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? J just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? Hmm. <laughs> uh, uh, shh. Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? We will not submit to intimidation or violence. 
but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Those fighting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> Creed my ass. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not. <clears throat> There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. Don't worry, our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there got to struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Right. Ah. Hmm. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. How about it, baby girl? Not so now, honey. Ha ha! Services have concluded for the day. 
We will provide an update on the schedule first thing tomorrow morning. Thank you for your patience. Emergency train services hmm? are now... Ah. Hmm? What kind of... Some plays only had it so good because of the reactors. Yeah, well, shoes on the other foot now. Let's see how daylight finds us. Mm. It's like a giant candle lighting up the whole sky. All that debris piled up like mountains. You couldn't go nowhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> what the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako junkie, huh? Figures. shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up? <laughs> You're such a kidder. Remember the last time I saw a real one? Huh? How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Yeah, yeah, your money. Ask Tifa. She takes care of all that. Do you mind keeping Marlene company until I'm done with this? Me? Yeah, you. Uh. Hey! Uh, what the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey, I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. Turn to the planet? Of course. Mm. 
Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was chaotic. Sorry the for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in danger crazy. like that. I, I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. Hmm. I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Hmm. Not good at all. So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. We not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. So, One of my friends said they it wasn't burning. that bad? I it thought was. reactors were safe. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with 7th Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always There's get it. There's one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2000 remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. And you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best. I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. Guess it's time for introductions. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in.
you doing to Marco? This is his apartment. He's got a few problems, but he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you... Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Huh. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jesse put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? Uh, Please? Uh, let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour.
Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry. We'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his rounds, too. As long as I get it all today. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to... Wait, let me see. Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look? in the market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teeth is with you. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's is a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Can't help but take a little pleasure in their panic. More than a little. Apparently, it was done by a terrorist group called Avalanche. This is the first time that nothing's been reported. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for you. Tifa, my dear, dear girl. Oh, what's he doing here? Working? 
Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit. Big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You the watch is saying they're gonna step now? up their game. Five years, give or take. But never mind that. We've gotta get you your money. Last stop is the weapon store. Trains don't start moving again. Hey, if it isn't Tifa. You here for the filter? Uh -huh. Hey! That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted-ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connection. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the neighborhood watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. Huh? I ain't got nothing for a punk-ass bitch like you! Get on out of here! No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Speak with our friendly staff to find the perfect weapon for you and your needs. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. Gotta do something about the monsters on. Huh? Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Um, Looking to join the neighborhood watch? That depends. What does this neighborhood watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows... But we'll work something out. For example... Aha! What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. It's fine just the way it is. What? You some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done.
All set. Needless to say, you'll have to try. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Mercantown. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud, I'll come with. No, I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? We don't. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Boulevard is out west. Past the barricades, supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare just in case. Good luck, Tifa, and be careful. Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters would feel right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. Show me what you got, Cloud. Take the lead. All set. There. That's that. Bye. Wow. So that's what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm-up. <laughs> I'll bet. Let's keep at it. Let's do this. Bring it on. Keep it together. Don't overdo it. Let me handle this. Come on. You're good at this. Charging in like it was nothing. You too. Looks a little surprised. Keep it together. All set. By the way, that one's gonna be on your head. Let's do this. Uh, okay. Let's run. <laughs> All right. I think that might be the last of them. We won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right. Let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge.
someone got rid of all the monsters on Scrap Boulevard? No, that was supposed to be me! Back already? Got every last one, too. Now the slums should be safe. You guys are machines! Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. I've got to ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you gotta do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. <clears throat> oh. You okay? I'm fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Sorry, Go on. maybe uh. next time. Her? No fair! Her. Think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Uh. <sighs> hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on Scrap Boulevard? You know, there's a doesn't look that strong. Hold up. Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. Uh. Man, in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. Don't be a stranger. Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know. Could toss some work your way. Where is he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Huh. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our... You hear 
here someone got rid of all of us. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on the ground? That's the guy who ran the monsters off the boulevard. Just look at that sword of his. Tally of Monsters Plane has been updated. We've got new numbers for Monsters Plane this month. Check them out. Searching for candidates. Ooh. You know how Turf can be a touchy subject in all Oh, hey there, Chiva. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, uh, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself at these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. Candidate detected. Performing fifth sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health. An optimal candidate. My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. You're gonna have to talk to your clients if you want all the details. I hear you sell swords. I want to introduce yourself to the so much about. You're not here to shop, are you? People were right. You look like you can handle yourself. So some drakes have made themselves at home in the abandoned Talliger factory. Can't have that kind of trouble around here. My regulars will do anything to get their hands on the scrap in there, and if they run into those drakes, they could get hurt. I'll handle it. Much obliged, sir. Head on over to the old Talliger factory.
is the planet the living being? <clears throat> Factory's off... Factory's off limits. Drakes have been spotted inside. Huh? Wait a minute. Tifa? Don't tell me you're here to take care of those things. Are you? In that case, be my guest. We believe there's at least two groups lurking somewhere inside the factory. Find and cull them all.
This won't take long. That's all. Just like that. Okay? in doubt. You're dead. Just like that, okay? I got gotcha. you.
If this is what you want. Yeah. Don't overdo it. I got you. Got rid of those drakes in the factory, did ya? What a relief. I can't wait to give my regulars the good news. You're the real deal, all right. Keep it up, and I can see you going far as a merc in this town. I've worked with my fair share over the years, so believe me when I say that I know what I'm talking about. Anyway, you're needed over at the pillar. Apparently another flying bastard stirring up trouble. Bet you can't get enough of this, huh? Well... No, I get it. If you're good at something, might as well make it your living. May not know you. I know a man who's found his calling when I see one. Keep at it. I switch out my stock every so often, so drop by when you're in the neighborhood, huh? That went well. Could be you found your calling. Eh. Uh, was all right, I guess. Think of each job as an opportunity. Not to make money, but to build connections. It's not what you know, but who. <laughs> you remembered. Not a patient teacher. <laughs> Maybe not so patient next time. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, Barrett should have finished collecting his share of the money by now. So what do you want to do? Head back to the bar? Tifa, welcome back! And you, the new merc in town looking for work, right? Yeah. In that case, maybe you could do something about the Doom Rats? Them and their were-rat buddies have been tearing up town looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't I. I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway, they're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were rat in pain will call its friends for help. And the whole rat pack will come running just like that. All the items you can want, straight from the place. No matter your needs or your budget.
see any doom rats around. Hmm. What do you think? Should we wait? No, this might be a waste of time. Let's head back to the store and touch base for now. Too much to handle? I'm just messing with you. Heard you took out some rare rats, which is nice and all, but the job was to wipe up the doom rats. No big. Get back out there and finish the job, and we're good. Don't look so glum. It's only a matter of time until they show. You'll get them this time for sure. All the items you can want. Yes. Worked up a good sweat. Finally managed to get those doom rats, huh? 
Thanks, guys. You're the greatest. Hear me out. If the guy who took care of the town's rat problem told everybody where he liked to shop, well, what do you say? I'll make it worth your while, of course. Give you some incentive. Talk you up to Weimer and my customers and anybody else who listen. You'll be swimming in work before you know it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, then. That's what I like to hear. Seventh Heaven, the new merc in town in my little store. I can see it now. We're gonna clean up. Son? I hear you sell swords. I want to introduce yourself. A certain shopkeeper told me you paid him a visit. Thanks for helping him out. Just so happens there's another job I'd like to offer you. Now that I know you can handle yourself in a fight, you've got a real killer on the loose, you see. A rabid catch dog. Maybe you've heard people talking about it. Shinra Muck gone feral. Last sighting was in Scrap Boulevard. Think you're up to it? I'll handle it. You're a lifesaver. Doubt anyone else around here stands a chance. Go get him, bud. Is there anyone who can chase off that blood fish? Anything because something came to me. Keep up the good work, Tifa. No turning back. Take the lead. Let me handle it. Get down.
for a shower. Took care of the dog, did you? Phew, we owe you one. Gotta say, I've never seen a Shinra breed like that before. Out of curiosity, when exactly did it show up? Oh, today. The first reports came in just this morning. Uh, why do you ask? Wait a minute. There's this crazy story about a Shinra research lab hidden right beneath our feet under the slums. Huh. Really? That's news to me. <laughs> and here I thought you might know something I don't. Well, I guess not. It's a big organization. I'm sure, there's lots of secrets I don't know. Yeah, fair enough. You got the bastard. That's good enough for me. Orb of assessed materia to your equipment and use it to gather battle intel. It took some real skill to How about joining the watch? Thanks for dealing with that filthy animal. Huh? Thanks. Something's wrong. Let's check it out. Stay away from me! Hold it! Settle down now. Get off me, assholes! I didn't do shit! Shut up, punk! Or what, huh? Screw you! What's going on? Somebody went and stole some blasting aid from a Shinra warehouse. So public security started asking questions, and you know how Johnny gets. Because of the reactor bombing, I bet. I could be wrong, but something tells me they're not gonna settle for just roughing him up this time. We've gotta save him, Cloud. Is he Avalanche? No. 
He doesn't really know what we do. But he has his suspicions. And he's a talker. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should go alone. I'm coming. Uh, oh, are you sure? It's the least I can do. Lead on. <sighs> Thanks. Come on. Glad we no longer have a rat problem. Citizens don't steal blasting agent. So why don't you tell me why your ID popped when we were going over the warehouse logs? Huh? You got it all wrong. I've never gone anywhere near a Shinra warehouse. My ID. <laughs> your ID was never lost, dumbass. But it never got you inside a Shinra installation in the first place. But tell me, we'll take all the time to story. I swear. All he had to do was keep his mouth shut. Yep. Anyway, you distract the officers and I'll... Let him go. Hmm? Who are you? The cavalry? Huh? Is that, is that who I think it is? Oh, hell yeah! You guys really came to save me! Ow! Oh, let go! Oh, oh, oh. Hey! What do you think you're doing? Here we go. <laughs> Keep it together. All set. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Do one thing. It's Hang nothing. back. Gotcha. First aid. No holding back. Give me your best shot. Bring it. Here we go. Yeah. Time to burn. Let's get this over with. See ya. No holding back. You're mine. So, is it over? Yo, anybody there? If you're there, then help me! What now? He's a talker. Huh? Whoa, whoa! No! You're not gonna... Hold up! Wait! Don't, don't do it, man! You wanna live? Then get the hell out of town. You got it, boss! You ain't never gonna see my face again! I swear! <laughs> Are you sure about this? It's a big risk. I know, but... It's fine. And them? No more. Cloud... You're scaring me. We need to go before they wake up. I... I'm worried about Johnny. I'm more worried about us. We gotta go, right? Right. What? It's just... You've really changed. How? I suppose it's... Yeah. Your eyes. They used to be less... It's the Mako. Soldier, remember? I remember. So, what do you want to do now? Head back to the bar, or do you want to tackle another job or two?
And here we are. You must be tired. Same as you, I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey, do you think you'll stick around a little longer? Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. In that case, want to head back out and look for more gigs? Yeah, why not? Well, you want to head inside? We're back. Did you have fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey, need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene. Want to go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay. You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. Sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime, <laughs> grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. <laughs> say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even the blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings, so if it comes down to do or die, if I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Could still kill some time.
What was up with that girl anyway? deal, huh? What was up with that girl anyway? Real deal, huh?
Maybe just chill a bit. you're having second thoughts I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference <laughs> 